as well. Oh, I'm hiding the chat. Shit. Okay, if, if someone is watching, can you confirm sound? We do have sound. I tried. Okay, yeah then, uh, hello everyone, uh, we will um, be playing the games from uh, our awesome Game Jam participants today. And uh, yeah, Patrick is joining us. How are you, Patrick? I'm very good. I just, one second ago, I finished building my, my new chair, so now I'm able to sit down in my flat, um, which is great. So I have a new desk and a new chair, okay. and um, so I don't have to work from my bed anymore. Which now you're sitting at your standing desk. Yes. Yeah, first time. Great. Uh, can you show your chair? Or no. It? Okay. Okay. I can't. Ah, Not you, really. <laughs> I see you don't want to show your room. Okay. Yeah, my, my room is. I, I can't even. It's very dirty. Um, I'm just living in cardboard. So no, no, no. Okay. Yeah. One day uh, I'll make one of these fancy posts with like, this is my work set up and then I'll show my minimalistic desk and my chair and everything and it's gonna be amazing. Yeah, you everyone. should do like a, a room tour on your YouTube channel. <laughs> no. um, yeah, I guess we just get started with the first game. Um, so it's, it's six games in total. Um, I think we will play eight minutes each so we get done in one hour. Um, I will set a timer because um, some games definitely require a little bit more time. Mm -hmm. uh, but we can't do that. <laughs> okay, so the first game, uh, I guess I will play it. Um, just have to check OBS uh, a little bit bigger. Patrick in the in the chat we're not playing the Ada Ninjas game. It has nothing to do with the game jam actually. Um, Ada Ninjas game is coming out very soon, but uh, not today. <laughs> yeah, so a uh, collab mentor. The first game um, actually by another Cardano project. Um, I just check their name. Ah, by uh, Crypto Heroes. Yeah, it's Crypto Heroes. Ah, it says it in the... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, okay. But it Not it looks very good. Like, the first screen already looks very, very yeah. good. Yeah, I think the guy had um, experience with Game Jams already. Um, he was writing in the chat the day the Jam started that he did, like, 10 Ludum Dares already. For 10? That's more than we did. That's really a lot. Okay, okay. That's, uh, let's focus on the game. Okay, I'm just moving with the arrow keys. I played it a little bit already and it was um, very cool so far. Uh, yeah, I, I really like the press M to mint. And <laughs> the eyes are also amazing. Okay, so yeah, now the, the collaboration um, aspect starts because the theme for the game jam was collaboration, so every game should have something to do with that theme. Um, yeah, so I can switch which character I'm playing. And, well, okay, just stepping on the switch. It's like super polished. I, it looks so good. Yeah, they used uh, Gador as well. So. Um, Godot. Godot. Um. No, it's, it's, it's Gadot. <laughs> Um, yeah, I should try it sometime. It's 
seems like a cool engine. It is a cool engine, but it's also like you have to learn something new and so on. But holy shit, it's really good. I'm very impressed. Um, it, I mean, it makes a lot of sense well, that you that you can switch the characters for the theme collaboration. Mm. I love the NFT Maker logo and how it's like coming down. Yeah, of course, bonus points for NFT Maker logo. Yeah. I love, you know, there are multiple different uh, functionalities, like the the upslide thing, that's really cool. And the way the way this uh, minted picture comes up is so cool. Like now, now the only thing missing is actually uploading it to NFT Maker and making it so that you can really mint it when you finish the level. Yeah, I think there were plans for that, but the time was a little bit too short. So now it's difficult. Ah, I used the character on the top. Um, yeah, I was struggling so much here last time because I didn't get that you can... Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't get the that you thing can... Is, I, I can't play, I can only watch because it's a solo game, right? And I, I don't even have a mouse here, unfortunately. So I have to watch Peter play and Peter is extremely bad at playing video games. No, He's good I'm at amazing at... Okay, maybe I... <laughs> <laughs> I will get it this time, um, I focus. You, you just uh, talk about your day and I will finish this level. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now I'm going to talk about the, the design. Okay, so... I like... I like the double jump. I mean, hey, even the double jump functionality. Ah, oh, he's so bad. Oh my god. Oh, um, I'm doing it right. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I, so the, the stream that I'm seeing is slightly delayed, um, <laughs> but I like the, the double jump, I like the characters, but uh, it's only only one different uh, enemy, but um, that's fine, it's a game jump after all. I like the whole, um, what do you call it, ladder, so that you can jump up and then you um, go up on, on the ladder and then you, it's kind of like Mario, Mario right? Um, I like the background, I like the design a lot, I like the title of the name. <laughs> Peter is not gonna make it. I'm gonna make it. Not that difficult, honestly. It is, because the enemies kill you instantly. <laughs> and they are really... Did you see the speech bubbles for the enemies? I did. The, the speech bubbles are also really cool. Okay, uh, uh, I have to open it again. This is really, like for a third level, it's really intense already because you have to manage that you um, get the enemies in this one section so they can't attack you. Mm -hmm. Okay, I did it. Whew. Perfect. Nice. Yeah, let's, let's look at the next level, um, but we probably won't finish it. I won't finish it because I'm too bad. Yeah, I think so too. Um, maybe it will be Okay. They also made a lot with like, very little. It's, it's really cool. It's the, t <laughs> the shooting <laughs> always scares me. <laughs> um, I don't know how to open that door. Ah, okay, I wait until he's... Okay, I got it. I will wait until he uh, goes up. Awesome. So then I can go down, but he will fall down again, so that, that's stupid. Okay, now I have to... What? That didn't do what I expected. Ah, you can't come. I'm lost. Peter has an extremely loud keyboard, by the way. Screen. Yeah, <laughs> I, I think I have to restart. Okay, so this does this. Patrick, what do I do? I'm, I, I'm confused as well. Um, okay. I thought with your delayed, I can't really help you. Okay, but, but you see the level. You can yeah, yeah, plans. I see the level. 
Um, ah, I know. I think the enemy has to step on the um, trigger. Ah, yes, you're right. But that's the wrong side. Okay, I just stay here. Go upstairs. Okay. And then you... Now he will fall down and I... <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> that that was the time. Um, but really good game. Really good game, actually. Yeah, really good game. And uh, Peter, can you tell us where we can download the games if we want to? Play? Yeah, you can uh, go to um, nftmaker.io slash game jam. Um, I will add it to the description. I only added the voting page, but uh, yeah, there you can download and play all the games. Okay. So, I, I will try to make the transition between games smooth, but uh, I have to Kay. do a you, few you, things. You do the transition, I do, I don't know, I, I talk about uh, video games. Okay. So my favorite video game is StarCraft 2. Unfortunately, no one ever wants to play it with me, um, which is kind of sad. And I, I'd actually tried to get Alessandro to play StarCraft with me, but he hates it and he, he's like one of these League of Legends. Hey Nino, hey Patrick, hey Nino, stage back of the channel. So AMG for life. Very cool name. Okay, I can't put this in window mode, that's a real problem. But let's see. Yeah, and uh, just to entertain you guys as well. So, so basically, Peter and I we um, studied together, not in university, but in um, high school. Basically, the last two years of high school, and we were always trying to make video games. So we kind of we kind of found a way, like we didn't really study anything with video games, but we found a way to incorporate video games into most of our projects. So one time, uh, we we had to do. I don't even know what the project was anymore, but we had to... We, we basically made it so that we were able to build a video game about a pomp frit. Um, and then you had to move the pomp frit around and, and catch things, I think. I'm not even sure anymore, but it, it was really strange. And um, yeah, it was really fun actually to do. And then we never finished it, and we never published it, of course, because we always we always started video games, and then we uh, never finished them. We just went on and did other projects, and we never finished them. So. Okay, I think we should see the game now, but uh, I'm really not sure. I, w I will have to wait a few seconds for yes. the stream to catch up. But yeah, uh, the the fry game was amazing. Or oh, the fry game, yeah. Okay, no, it doesn't uh, look good on the stream. Oh no! <laughs> oh, it's amazing, Phil is. Um, I'm, I'm double echoing, yeah, because Peter has his uh, microphone to load. Uh, um, uh, okay. His, his no great feedback. I uh, should be better now. Okay. Um, okay, I will just try a different game for now because this is uh, too complicated. Phil, our customer support, actually just posted a, um, a tweet saying that <laughs> his two bosses are playing video games while he has to work. <laughs> and it's very fun. Well, it's after uh, 6 p.m. already, so I guess it's uh, free time. That's not true. We no, don't it's have not true. working times, Peter. <laughs> I, I woke <laughs> up at 10, uh, actually later than that. I woke up at 11, so I'm still full, fully on on my schedule. Okay, this is, uh, mm, it's a struggle because I can't play the games in window mode, um, which means they are, um, well then our screens won't play, so I guess we will play the games without our face. Ah, I see. Yeah, okay. Ah, that's because you, you only have one uh, monitor. I, I keep telling you to buy more than one monitor. Yeah. 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 Um, no, I have a better idea. We'll just stream my whole screen. 
just brute force it. Yeah, but it, it's working now. It's working now? Yeah, check out the stream. Okay. No. Um, so actually, Niels just asked, uh, did most of the NFT maker team come from the same high school or university? So the, the three founders, Peter, uh, Fahim and I, we, we all came from the, from the same high school. And then we kind of split off and we all did separate things. Um, so Peter studied um, Internet of Things, Fahim studied um, in interaction design, I studied um, computer science, and then we came together and then we made an team maker. And um, yeah, and basically what happened after that is we we got a lot of our friends into the company. So for example, I brought in um, Max, who's now the marketplace lead. It's working, right? Should I continue with my story or? Maybe I think, uh, yeah, just <laughs> continue with your story, I will, um... It looks really cool though. Okay, let me finish the story, uh, just, just one second. Yeah, so basically, um, we all brought in our friends, so we brought, I, I brought in Max, uh, Peter, uh, Fine brought in uh, designer friends, and so on, so we, most of the people are actually friends or family in some sort, and very close to us, but now we're like 24 people or something like that, so it's like very close as well, we have people in in the US, we have people in Brazil, we have people everywhere, so it's not only us, but the, I would say the core the core people, core founders, those are all very um, very much the same university and so on. Okay. So, uh, tell me about this, this game. Let's yeah, it's uh, made by uh, Cardano Freaks, um, ah. and to be honest, so Cardano Freaks is, I uh, guess, long time friend from the Cardano community um, and he made the art as far as I know and uh, Tobias is also a programmer uh, who was like the, the boyfriend of my flatmate <laughs> so they uh, teamed up for this and uh, yeah I think it looks really cool um, so the gameplay um, as far as I understand it is that I walk around and collect things like uh, those seashells and coconuts and my goal is to get on the ship that's like on the right um, okay I, I will walk over faster <laughs> um, yeah so there's the um, no there's not the boat <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's called uh, uh, Isle Escape, so I guess uh, it's, it's a little bit of an escape room. <laughs> and I can it's actually really cool, like it's very large. Um, the chat, by the way, said that I'm too quiet, maybe you have to turn on the volume again. But either way. Um, okay, you are what? Too quiet. Ah, okay, yeah, if it's... You if you can't understand me, then the chat can also not understand me. Okay, then I will, like, turn the sound up and manually turn my speakers down. Yes, makes sense. Okay, should be better now, I hope. Cool. So no, no one heard your story about how we got started. Great. Yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I, I trade with people, um, and they then take the seashells and give me uh, wood mm -hmm. and the guy who builds the ship he wants wood so mm -hmm. my my main objective is there he is uh, to give him all the wood he needs and then I get to the next level mm -hmm. very cool yeah yeah and like you said the levels are really big and uh, um, the art also is pretty amazing for uh, this short time it's really good yeah I mean you can see of course that they reuse the same tiles over and over again but that uh, that's exactly how you do it basically and they, they made like a really big and diverse world map in a way um, with very few resources so it's really good actually I love it um, 
But, yeah, but so what is the goal? Like, I, I don't quite get. So you, you have to trade the seashells for wood, and then what do you do with the wood? I give the wood to the um, guy who builds the boat, and then... Ah, okay, and how much wood do you need to collect? That's the thing, I don't know that. <laughs> okay, I think we need to definitely play through it. Through the whole game? Yeah, I mean, we need to get off the island. Well, I'm... yeah, but it's already the second island you uh, talked over oh, the... <laughs> yeah, 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 right, it's the second one. Yeah. Oh, yeah, but I've look, the gold is almost ready. Okay, so I have one shell more. Like, the thing is always, do I keep looking for more uh, things to find, or do I go to the next trader uh, and hope that it's uh, enough? Yeah. But I don't know where the seashell trader is. Ah, there she is. Okay. I hope this in is the last piece of wood. In what engine thing. was this made, do you know? Uh, yeah, uh, it's Unity, right? Yeah, it's Unity. Mm -hmm. Okay, next island. Um, I'm so jealous that I didn't get to participate in this game jam. Game jam, it's so cool. Yeah, you should have joined. I think and the I, I consensus the next is meeting. not important enough to miss the game jam. Yeah, unfortunately, consensus was very good. Uh, but next Ludum there is in over 100 days, I think. So it's like super far away. But I think a Game Maker's Toolkit will do a jam really soon, or maybe we already missed it. Mm. They also do really cool game jams uh, that are... Because they are like a game development focused channel, the themes are always interesting. Okay. Yeah, there's, it's slightly... Um, out of the screen on the left, uh, I also have, uh, let me check what it is, coconuts, okay, yeah, I guess you can't see us anyway, so I um, can leave it like this. Yeah, I don't know why you didn't just put it over the whole screen. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> because I tried to push it to the edge uh, so you can still see us. You cannot see us. <laughs> no, you cannot. Yeah. Yeah, well, I guess this is a little bit, um, you could, um, I don't know if the large levels were necessary, like it um, takes a long time to get through it. Yeah, but still, it's, I, I like it. Um, it's a good concept. Of course, it's it's quite basic in a way um, because you just have to collect stuff. But it's it's still it's very nice. Um, I'm noticing that the coconut trader isn't giving me anything back for the coconut, so I will <laughs> stop doing that. Okay, <laughs> I need uh, the seashell trader. can find uh, the trading person within the next minute. Yeah, when was the last game jam we did together? Uh, I have no idea, but it was a long time ago. Oops, sorry. Um, like, I don't know, one and a half years or longer? Probably. Yeah, I participated in one Ludum Dada, but you uh, weren't there. Yeah. Okay, found it. This should be it. 25 seconds left. There's no run button, but I will do it. Also, <laughs> I forgot where I have to go. Also, if you if you walk not in a straight line, but if you walk like uh, in a diagonally, it's it's faster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, it looks like it. Okay. It's that. This is one of these things which everyone does. Like. Everyone has the same problem. Even, even um, what's this game called? Uh, Undertale. Undertale is this really famous game, and they have the exact same thing. It's very interesting. Yeah, but also it's it's an interesting problem because um, like uh, Xbox and PlayStation controllers handle input differently. Um, 
Yeah. Because you, you saw the gif right on Twitter that uh, one of them rounds off the corners and the other one just goes to, oh, it wasn't enough. Okay, next game. Uh, yeah, so um, Xbox controllers will actually give you an uh, output of 1-1 one, one if you push all the way diagonally while uh, a PlayStation controller will give you something like 7.5 on both axes. So um, you have to tune for uh, different controllers. That makes it difficult. Um, yeah, I really want to play uh, I Drive You Shoot, um, which is a co-op game. It's an online multiplayer co-op game. So can you download it? Um, I will try. Give me one yeah. second. There's a, a spammer in the chat, but I can't ban them. Um, Are you know. not logged in or? No, I'm not logged in. Okay. I can do it. Wait, wrong. Uh -huh. Um. Hmm. Okay, done. Nice, this was the first time I banned anyone, so... Okay, which one was it? I drive, you shoot? Yes. Okay. I can also uh, just play another game where you download. No, no, I'm, I'm ready. Um, you are ready? Okay. <laughs> I'm ready. Um, okay, I will start the game. No access. Firewall, wow. Oh. The monitor is really small. <laughs> this is so small. Um, okay. Okay, did you uh, make a server? Uh, I, I clicked on enter lobby. Okay. So, yeah. It even does, it, it even has a search and connects you to that. That's really cool. Actually. Yeah, I was also like, holy shit, how did they do it in this short time? Also, it seems to be working on the stream uh, immediately. No. But now it, uh, it should, I hope. I, I think I have a weird bug with OBS because it's like it works, but it's not showing the game. Okay, sorry guys, back to the uh, other crappy solution, but it works in this case. Okay. It's very small now. Okay, signed in. Oh my god, it really works. <laughs> wow. Wait. Where's the music coming from? Is it coming from me? Oh, do I have to do something? Oh no, I'm not ready. I'm also not ready. The space, the jump. Okay. Um, okay. <laughs> I was totally not ready. What, what do I have to do? Ah, I yeah, can only shoot. No. You can jump with space. How do you find space to jump? Ah, okay. ah, ah, now I get it. Okay. You have to shoot and I have to jump. Can you, can you say something? No, is, is the music really loud for you? I guess you can't hear me. Are you still there, Peter? No, I'm still there. Ah, okay. Yeah, yes, yes. Okay, one second. Okay. Shoot more! I'm, I'm shooting, I'm shooting, sorry. No, I've, I think I have limited uh, shots per uh, second or something. Yeah, I, this, this collaboration really cool. aspect is really strong here. Oh no, shoot. Now I can't shoot anymore. <laughs> oh. ah. Shoot, shoot, shoot! Dude. Uh, 
I'm gonna score 45. But you can, uh, like, they can touch you, it's just about not getting pushed away. Yeah. Ah, it says how many shots I have left, so now it's only one. Ah, okay. I'm, I'm still, like, the most impressed I'm with, um, with the, how, how, how they made the search, so that, uh, that you got automatically paired with another player. That was really bad, sorry. Um, because that's kind of, like, kind of difficult. It's not, it's not, like, P2P, basically, it's, it's actually with a server. Yeah, yeah, we even said, like, in the opening stream, <laughs> Don't try to make a multiplayer online game, but uh, yeah, someone did it, uh, we were wrong. stop yeah yeah cool game um, but I think we saw everything but okay. that's like that is definitely amazing I have to say all three games that we just played they were all extremely good like they were much better quality all of them than I expected so <laughs> well done you want to say much better quality than anything we ever made in game jams uh, no, we made good stuff. We yeah. made party poopers, so... Yeah, you know. right, party pooper. No one I, can I don't think people. anyone is trumping party poopers. Oh, I think it, it's working. No, okay. I, for a moment I thought I can have Discord in front, but uh, no. Um, yeah, I think you will like this game. Can you see the stream uh, already? Um, no. One second. It's loading. I will just... Okay, yeah, now, now I can... Elemental Nations, an open-world sandbox game inspired by democracy mechanics from the elemental genre. Convinced two nations of alchemists to collaborate, combining the elements and creating a new element. Um, open the map, click on the nation, then press E and follow the instructions to propose a combination. Both votes need to be green for the proposal to pass. I like it. <laughs> I like it already. Yeah, I have no idea what the elemental genre, uh, genre is, but uh, it sounds cool. Maybe we have to find out. Um, okay, what do I press to spacebar to close? Okay. Um, okay, keyboard is not working. That's sad. I had an other... Oh, now it's... Okay. Had another version of this and it was working. But... Yeah. Um, yeah. I guess this happens because you don't have much time for testing, but uh, the guy actually uh, re-uploaded it because he uh, added some things. Or the, the girl, I don't know. Um, I will try to get the old version later. Mm. Cool. Then let's go with Space Adventures. Same spammer again. Mm. You know, the, one of the weird things in Switzerland and in Germany, is, I don't know if it's the same in other countries, is that every hour and every half hour and so on, they, they always ring the bells of the church for a very long time. You can probably hear it in my background. It's kind of annoying. Ok. 
Okay. So, next game. Uh, let me check the name. Um, by Andreas Papadopoulos. <laughs> I think our screen is um, not. Ah, yeah. Hard. Because I. I uh, yeah, so um, he said this is actually his first game, if I understand it right. Like, first game ever. And uh, yeah, I like what I'm seeing. I can't see it yet. <laughs> oh no. Ah, oh, no, I do. Oh, it's a space bar. Yeah. Yeah, the art is strong, um, nice music in the background. I guess the question would be what uh, is collaborative here? It's incredible how bad you are at playing video games. Why am I bad? <laughs> I'm just like jumping. <laughs> Do you want to play it instead? Maybe. Yeah? yeah, Just, yeah. Then do you download the next game and... Okay, now I'm back. No, no. It's already spontaneous enough. Um, but yeah, it looks really good, good actually. Um, it works very well. I like the space button design. Um, I don't understand why he's shivering like that when you're not moving. I think we have to restart it. Yeah, I think that's um, on purpose actually. That's, uh, he uh, did two um, sprites and swaps them out to make it look uh, animated. Okay, mm. you, you don't sound impressed. No, it's I. It's okay. It just looks a little bit weird, but but I, I like the rest. Um, and uh, and I can't see it because it's always so delayed. So it's kind of weird when you say something. I can't see it yet. Oh, um, yeah. but, sure. Um, I like the background especially. It really feel, feels like like in outer space. Yeah, it's mostly just really difficult because the jumps are very precise. Or maybe you're just not good at jumping. If I'm good at anything, it's jumping. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, I, I just fell down for your information. I will try it one more time. We'll be really patient this time. Yeah, Patrick, so I guess uh, next NFT Game Maker, uh, NFT, NFT Game Jam will happen. NFT Maker Game Jam, so now I got it. Uh, and you will join next time, right? Yeah, of course. I, I, I want to participate. I want to just make a game in 48 hours and, and wow everyone. Yeah, just make sure you don't fly to America while it's happening. Make sure you don't plan the next game jam while I'm gone. I've planned it before you booked the flight. That's not true. It totally is. No, it's definitely not true. I booked the flight very early. Okay, I'm dead again. <laughs> but good, cool game. Game. good game. Yeah. Very I don't cool. get the collaborative part, yes, but uh, besides that, it's very good. Especially for uh, his first try. Oh, it's his first try even? Wow. Yeah. That's incredible. That's very impressive, yeah. Well done. Okay. Yeah, we have two games left now, and... Um, mm -hmm. Oh, I'm... Ah, no, I set it up right. Uh, yeah, one of them is... Um, Vaults with lasers. Um, 
which I didn't understand when I looked into it, and the other one is Elemental Nations, which um, we will have to download the other version. So let's uh, try the lasers game and then download the other one. Okay. Is there any kind of workaround we can do so you see it? Not, not really. Um, yeah. Yeah, so I'm uh, here with those uh, in this room. Looks pretty cool. And with the laser, but if I walk into the laser, I immediately die. And the level restarts. And uh, what I didn't try last time is using the mouse, but it doesn't seem to be helping. This may be the creator in the chat. Yeah, Kota, we uh, will definitely show our game as well. <laughs> <laughs> this looks really cool as well. It, it's very smooth. Yeah, it looks uh, kind of like a portal or something, but um, yeah. I don't know how it works. I like so I like isometric games. Like you have to push the, the block into the... I'm pretty sure you have to push the block. Okay, okay. Let me switch around again and try. No, but no, it doesn't work. Because if you read the text, it says, uh, let's oh, collaborate and drop the vault. Uh, I can't be with you, but I can hack into the laser and clear a path to the treasure for you. Um, so yeah, some someone would need to help me, but I don't know how. It, how. Let's collaborate and drop. I have no further advice for you. Let's go. Yeah, come on, Peter. Let's try. Um. Yeah. What? Okay. Yeah, I want to figure it out because it looks so cool, but I have no idea. Um. In a sec, it's kind. Of, it's hard to say, see because I can't read the text. Um, your monitor is too big, Peter. I'm Zach, your partner. Let's collaborate and drop the wall together. I can't be with you, but I can hack into the lasers and clear the path for you. Hack. Um, so, can you press enter or something? Like it's something you have to type something. Probably. You think? I yes. thought maybe I have to press the number one because the laser says one, mm -hmm. but uh, it doesn't work. Uh -huh. hmm. Even emailed uh, the person who made it today, but didn't get a response yet. Yeah, well, uh, I guess uh, don't figure it out. Very sorry about that. Hmm. Yeah, but please let us know um, like what we have to do because this is actually really cool and uh, yeah, even like the laser has bloom and everything. Good looking game. Sure, it's a great puzzle game. Um. <laughs> I like how it's like falling so super slowly when you die. Yeah, it kind of reminds me. Do you remember this? first game I made with the with the bean figures who turned into flowers. Yes. They I also do. fell over like that. <laughs> <laughs> True. Okay, yeah. yeah, downloading um, Elemental Nations now. I uh, think the person who made it is uh, actually crazy because... Um, <laughs> no, you can't call them crazy. <laughs> no, like crazy um, good at what they're doing is what I mean. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because uh, yeah, I I downloaded it. Uh, no, he he uploaded it after forty eight hours, and then he was like, "Oh, oops, I didn't know it was uh, seventy two hours. I already finished." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, I think that's kind of impressive. It is. It totally is. But sometimes, if you only have 48 hours, uh, it's even... Yeah, the, I mean, the last day is always so so painful because you're already so done with everything mm -hmm. and just keep pressing through the last day even though maybe 48 hours is enough okay i found it uh, still have it downloaded um hmm, weird seems to be a problem uh, on my side okay Can't walk is uh, walk is the problem. Um. I can't see it at the moment. So yeah, I know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just, uh. Okay, you can experience the um, it not working together with me. Okay, this is not optimal. This is bad. Okay, the map is working. Maybe if I... Um, maybe I don't walk the way you're supposed to walk. Have you tried the arrow keys? Yeah. <laughs> it's really weird. Um, Oh no. Um, maybe I try to plug in my mouse, but it's. Don't think it will make it. Maybe. Oh, oh, my PlayStation controller is working. Oh my god. <laughs> um, okay, if I unplug it, then I switch to the newer version again because um, because it's newer. I like how the how the um, red red humans, whatever, uh, walk, <laughs> like they just jump up and down, it's very funny. Um, yeah, you can appreciate them a lot soon. Okay, <laughs> James missions. Here we go. Okay, so again, uh, um, open world sandbox game inspired by the de democracy me mechanics from the em elemental genre. <laughs> okay, <laughs> didn't pronounce any word properly. <laughs> um, goal, convince two nations of alchemists to collaborate, combining their elements and creating a new element. Um, okay, I can open the map, map press E. Um, Okay, so I basically make them vote, so they collaborate. Yeah, already had um, a small look at it, um, so I, I think I walk around um, and I can make friends with people by uh, jumping next to them. Oh, it's not a jump anymore in the updated version. Uh, but still, a great way to make friends. Okay, <laughs> um, and it's a really cool concept. I, I like I like the whole nation thing. It's really fun, and it looked like it even has particle effects. It looks really cool. There's the fire nation, and water nation. Yeah, I also thought it's like Avatar, but apparently it's not, and we are uh, idiots for saying so. It's 100% like Avatar. Yeah, but it's. Inspired by the elemental genre, so... Yeah, I mean, Avatar is probably also inspired by the elemental genre. Yeah, but we have different, like, we have water, we have rock, fire, uh, and then we have wind and spirit, so it's not... Yeah, I mean, it's still, it's, it's still like Avatar, because spirit is the... Spirit is the... What's it called? Yeah, the spirit word. But yeah, the spirit world. Yeah, right, right. <coughs> exactly. 
hope the creator is not watching, he will be uh, angry at us. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so um, I just go to these people and make friends with them, and then I uh, build an extractor Ooh. in their. Um, yeah, I think I can extract uh, their friendship by building the extractor. <laughs> really good approach to uh, friendships here. Speaks to me. Okay, so. But um, yeah, just farming everybody at this point. But maybe let's make maybe the spirit. You focus on one. Yeah, let's make spirit and fire friends. F. Okay, three friends in both regions. I. Okay, pressing Q gives me the map. Okay, view proposal, oh, okay. Voting stream, no active proposal. Um, maybe I do the proposal on the map. Yes, okay, I'm proposing a collaboration between spirit and fire. Patrick, what element should we make? Uh, I don't know what element we can make because I don't see it yet. Ah, okay, so we have... Uh, we can name it however we want. Ah, okay, so let's make... Let's make Toblerone. <laughs> That's a stupid element, but okay. That's a good element. With two hours or just one? With one hour. Okay. Toblerone. Yes. Um, civilization name, I guess. Whatever you like. <laughs> okay. Oh, um, yeah, let's call it N Maker. <laughs> <laughs> and it should be very green. And we can even select a symbol. Guess the heart because our heart beats for N Maker. Okay. Guess I have my own nation now. Yeah, Patrick, I will wait for you to see it because it's kind of cool. Let me, yeah, it's, it's very cool. I like it. Have you placed it? Yeah, yeah I've okay. placed ah, it. Now, now I see it. Very, oh, that's really cool. That's really cool. Like, you can build nations and stuff. It's so, it's so nice. Actually. Yeah, strong collaboration. Um, but I don't know what make, I do now. Make the Endmaker Nation great again. <laughs> do it. Can I get people to come to my nation? I don't know how. Okay. They are not as friendly uh, as they used to be. Maybe I just make them stronger friends and they will come over. Do you think they are coming over? Um, I, I don't know. Um, maybe try. But I don't. I think you have to place maybe an extractor next to our nation or something like that. Ah. <laughs> Did you really not think of that? <laughs> it doesn't work, but. Uh... Oh. Ah, the, the circle of the nation gets bigger when I place something there. Maybe I can just fuse them at the point where our thing is placed. Okay. I'm really getting into this game.
Okay, Patrick, what's your favorite nation in Avatar? Um, that's a very difficult question. I'm okay, what's sure. your favorite Avatar? My favorite av Oh, that's that's also a very difficult question. But I, I think actually you had really, one. huh? I think you had yeah, one. Yeah, I, I really like Kyoshi. I think Kyoshi is the best. Is she the one who has the uh, statue? Uh, in yes, yes. Yeah, with the green people, right? Yeah, with, with the green people. <laughs> yeah. With the Earth Nation, yes. Yeah, one, one avatar uh, like franchise has blue people and the other one has green people. Okay, Peter. <laughs> Okay, but okay. I, as far as I know, um, actually the the Avatar movie, uh, not not the real life one, but the the show that the, the the cartoon movie that is being produced is about Kyoshi. So I'm very excited. Okay, yeah, that would be really cool. And I think they should make it really FSK 18 and um, just like have blood and gore everywhere. Yeah, yeah I think really into this. FSK is not a thing in America, but uh, yeah. What is not a thing? What you said, FSK, the, the German language. Oh, it's not oh, right. It's, it's R rated. Yeah, right. Okay, I don't have enough um, power to fuse the nations. Yeah, not a strong enough avatar yet. Okay, cool. Also very cool game. Also very ambitious for the short time. Yeah, very cool. I like it. Um, I think it's very experimental in a way. So that's that's very cool. And that's kind of what you like. There are always different approaches about game jams. Either you um, are extremely experimental and just try something out where you don't know if it's gonna work, or you just build something where you know that you can build it, and then you just polish it. And most of the time, the ba the games that really win the game jams, they, those are the games that um, are extremely well polished in a way. So yeah, I'll just keep, like, like people more. knowing what they are doing and not taking too many risks and polishing it, right? Yeah. Yeah. So um, Kota tells us she's going, but she wants me to show our game. Yeah, then uh, show our game. I actually had a call with Kota yesterday for ah. like. Two hours. It was very nice. I think I have so much background noise. Uh, no, it's fine actually. Yeah, it's raining really hard here. Um, okay, um, our game. I don't know where it is. So it, was this the last one, by the way, or do this we have another one? The last one, yeah. Okay. Okay, then really play yeah, uh, game. and again, f for uh, to everybody who is still here, uh, you can find the link to vote in the description. Mm -hmm. It's it's like two people watching, so it's me and you. <laughs> no, a, a few other people have been watching earlier, so and and earlier. I know Phil is still watching, so uh, and it's gonna become a video afterwards, so people yeah. are gonna. No, <laughs> I don't care. I was just <laughs> pointing it out. Um, so yeah. what were we talking about? Um, yeah, just that we play your game now. Okay, yeah, and you can vote. <laughs> yeah, you can vote. I think I need to make a Twitter thread with all the games and the vote as well. Yeah, please do. Okay, so this is our game. My favorite part about it is that we have a logo, but we don't have user interface for uh, the main mechanic. Yeah. So it's like uh, curling, like the, the game where you push a stone across ice and someone swipes with a broom in front of it. Yeah, and every um, all the stones are cute uh, stars or hearts. Yeah, we can't see it yet, actually. Yeah. <laughs> you will see it soon enough. So... Did you start it already? Or? Oh, yeah. Oh, maybe I didn't activate... Um, 
<laughs> I'm an idiot. Okay. Peter is so bad at streaming. Oh my well. god. Um, <laughs> no. It's not easy. I know, I know, it's very hard. I tried to become a streamer once, it was terrible. Um, you tried to become a streamer and it sounds interesting. And I used to watch for I used to work for Bonjour, so. I know how it is. I always failed. Yes, um, the, there's a question in the chat. Are winners determined by voting or by the team? Yeah, so um, I guess by um, voting. Voting is what we announced we will do. Um, so it's voting. <laughs> so we can see the game now. So, um, ah, nice. It looks so good, actually. Like it, like it's so polished. It looks so nice. Yeah, like I said. Um, so uh, it's delayed for you, but I will explain it for everyone else. So this grave, this grave thing is where you aim, and then when I click where I want to shoot, then I have those two bars, and the, the vertical one is how hard I shoot, and the uh, horizontal one is how much I spin my uh, thing. Um, so if I just do uh, no spin, we'll fly in a straight line, right? Um, but if I then just reduce the power to nothing and spin it really hard, it will just turn in place. <laughs> um, yeah, awesome. And of course it's curling, so the goal is to um, shoot it, but then spin it a little bit so it makes um, it curls. Yeah, and um, Patrick, do you know how curling is played? I do, actually. Yeah, and I, I think it's like kind of a cool game. Curling? Like real life curling or your turn? Um, like, I think real life curling is cool and the only stupid part is the swiping, but... Ah, okay. <laughs> I like the swipe. Yeah. So, um, in, in real life curling, the thing would, that usually happens is you just play a straight um, stone, and then the next person wants to get closer to the um, goal, which is the circle. Um, but because there's already a stone in the way, they will have to um, make a curve around it, so they don't push the other team's stone closer to the goal. Yeah, a lot of work went into the faces of the characters and no work went into the user interface. Uh, <laughs> that's what we made. I like it. I, I think it looks very good and very polished. And um, yeah, I don't know why like the lines are a little bit weird. But besides that... Which lines? On the ground? No, if you like the, the direction that you are dragging it in. Like why is there just a random... Box. A random uh, gray square. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's because it was like a half an hour before the jam ended, and I was like, "Okay, Kota, are you still up?" And she was like, uh, "He was like, yeah." And um, then he sent me a logo for the game, <laughs> and I was like, "Yeah, cool. <laughs> <laughs> really, really helps the game shape." <laughs> but it's a good logo, so who cares? Nice, well done. Yeah, okay. uh, and yeah, thanks everyone for sending you games. I think all of them were very good. They were. I, I'm very happy. Like we we had so many good uh, submissions, and I I'm I'm gonna play all of them on my own PC as well. Once I have my mouse. Um, and yeah, what's your favorite game, Peter? Can we say that, or is that influence? I, I don't think we can say that. That's um, okay. Or maybe we mm. can have favorites. Um, I think we can have favorites. Come okay. on. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I I have. So I'm not. I I think your game is the best polished one, but I am not going to count oh, that one because you. you don't <laughs> you can't submit it. Um, I think the game, like the first one, is of course that's like the, I, in my opinion, the big one um, because it's just extremely yeah, it's, well made. Yeah, it's more polished than our game. Don't. Yeah, it's probably more polished than you. <laughs> yeah. But it doesn't like yours looks cooler. It looks very good. But but the first one is yeah, the first one is like objectively probably the best game. 
but I also really like the um, the one with the nations because it's just yeah. more experimental and it actually tries something and I, I like that a lot. That's really cool. It's so ambitious and I don't think like we would fin would have finished this concept within this short time. Um, we never finish any concept in a short time. So. Yeah, so very well done there. Um, yeah, also like of course, uh, the, the island escape game is very cool. Um, yeah. I really want to know um, what the laser game is like. Um, because it's, it seems like it would be a good game. Yeah, and I also like that one of the games, um, the, the jump and run game, was his first game jam ever. I think that's really cool. Yeah, that's so good. And actually just finishing and submitting something and then it even looks good so and it plays good so that's very cool yeah and the multiplayer game every, oh right was that that was crazy as well i think the multiplayer game from a technology standpoint is probably the best one even though you know like doing servers like they probably use some unity package so it's probably not like super hardcore difficult to make but um but still it's like they're even if you use a package there's so much work that just goes into this multiplayer thing and I hope they never they've never done something like that before so that they learned something new but I, I don't know um, I think they have definitely done something like this before or, okay. or they oh. wouldn't just have the confidence to pull it off in a jam uh, I mean we tried a lot of things that we have never tried before no, not jam. everyone is as stupid as we are okay fair enough yeah <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, so, so to conclude, um, cool games all around, every game did something that made it stand out, and yeah. Mm. Great. Yeah, thank you very much for, for participating. I think it's a, well, Kota said the curling game is, is uh, their favorite, that's um, a little bit biased. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> No, uh, but I, I, I think this was a huge, huge success, actually, and I'm extremely happy. So thank you all for participating. And next time I'm going to be there and I'm going to make the best game ever. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure you will. Okay, yeah, yeah. Will. thanks everybody for watching and um, see you at the next Game Jam.